Well, people uh, certainly rely on computers to communicate, to inform themselves, and even to relax. But few people really understand the programs that drive them. Now that's changing. Developers are writing coding language so simple that even a child can learn them. More now from NHK World's Karuko Ishibushi. This programming workshop is offered by a nonprofit organization. The instructors are professional coding teachers. These elementary school students are deeply interested in the subject. They are having fun using coding tools that have been developed especially for children. When you want this cat character to move, first, drag and drop the block that says move 10 steps. The cat begins walking. Similarly, if you combine the blocks that say when green flag clicked forever and if on edge bounce, this is what happens. After a few lessons, the children are able to write programs that operate toys according to their instructions. It's fun to move the toys around in the way I want. Computer skills allow children to do or make lots of different things. These skills will help them connect with people around the world in the future. Programming education was introduced in junior high school two years ago, but it's now facing a big challenge. These teachers gathered to discuss the problem. Most of them lack the skills that professional coding instructors possess. And they need to teach students whose level of interest in programming is low. A programming expert says the important thing is to bring out children's creativity through interactive approaches rather than making them learn passively in a classroom. Children have the desire to make things themselves. Teachers should play the role of facilitators who bring out that desire. One new teaching approach is attracting attention. Here, the facilitators are children. It was the idea of Soto Yamauchi, who's 13 years old. Two years ago, Soto won first prize at the coding contest for kids 15 and younger. Soto taught programming to two classmates. The three of them are now teaching programming to 20 children. See, it's been reset. Now, you click this and then... Soto and the other children exchange ideas freely, as if they are playing a computer game. Once children learn how fun programming can be, their creativity and output kick into high gear. It's easier when children teach children because they have perspectives and ideas that are different from teachers. We'd like to pass on the joy of programming. The important thing is to create places where kids can learn coding in the same spirit as when they play with friends. Soto's approach has taught instructors one important lesson. If you're looking for the right way to teach children, sometimes it's best to ask a kid. Kaoru Koishibushi, NHK World.